Meet Anini and Masimba. Their maize farm in Zimbabwe has been providing for their family for generations. One day, while working in their field, they discovered dozens of insect larvae. They were fall army worms. Anini and Masimba had never seen these insects before and worried about how to protect their crops. Within days, the pest had eaten its way across the field, destroying their hope for a good harvest and food for their family that season. They soon learned that the fall armyworm is an invasive pest that eats more than 80 different crops, but has a particular preference for maize. Fall armyworm is native to the Americas. It was first reported in Africa in 2016 and quickly spread throughout the continent. In less than two years, it affected maize crops in more than 40 countries. Smallholder farmers were badly hit. In 2017, some lost up to 50% of their harvest. It reached India in 2018. It has since been reported in many other countries across Asia and the Pacific, and it reached Australia in 2020. Millions of families in these regions are highly dependent on maize for their income and their livelihoods. If the fall army worm keeps spreading, it will have disastrous consequences for them. It is estimated that the pest has caused around $3 billion worth of damage to maize crops across Africa. Without further management, it could cause much more damage to crops in Asia and the Pacific. Scientists at the International Maize and Wheat Improvement Center, also known as CIMIT, have been working hard to find solutions to help farmers fight fall armyworm. Researchers have developed manuals for farmers with guidelines on how to manage this pest. They have also formed an international research consortium where experts from diverse institutions are sharing knowledge and best practices. Consortium members share updates on progress in finding new ways to tackle this global challenge. The fall armyworm can't be eradicated. It is here to stay. Scientists are now working on developing new maize varieties that are resistant to fall armyworm. CIMIT and its partners worldwide will continue to work on this complex challenge so millions of smallholder farmers like Anini and Masimba can protect their crops and feed their families. For more information on fall armyworm and CIMIT's work, please visit CIMIT.org slash fall armyworm.